So hunters all around the world are showcasing through their actions how they're preserving and conserving wildlife and habitats and ecosystems. One of the examples is on the North Island of New Zealand and it's the newly formed Eastern Weo Link Project. And the Eastern Weo Link Project was established in 2020 by a group of hunters and fishermen and farmers who really wanted to ensure that this Weo, it's a blue duck, a rubber lip duck, as a national treasure of New Zealand, can flourish. And the reason it's not flourishing is because of the introduced predators that New Zealand has to deal with, stoats, rats, those kinds of things. But what have they done? They've established a 26 kilometer, that's about a 12 mile long trap line. Along those trap line, they've placed 260 traps that are designed to trap nest raiding stoats and rats. They've had over 50 volunteers over the year that has provided over 2,000 hours of volunteer time to inspect the traps, hunt the deer species to keep the population in check, uh, hunt the pigs to keep their population in check. So you've got pig hunters and deer hunters all contributing to the health of this ecosystem. So what's been their success? Is there a way that they've been able to track over a short period of time the success that they've had? Absolutely. All of the existing we au pairs that they've been able to identify have successfully fledged five to nine ducklings, i.e. that those eggs made it and the ducklings made it. So this is proof. This is proof of what hunters are doing for wildlife and ecosystems, specifically in New Zealand, but happens all over the world. Do you have a proof story? Do you have something that shows the proof of what hunting and hunters are doing for wildlife and ecosystems? If you do, send it to us. I want to see it, I want to hear about it, and we want to push that message out.